guess the final question which we'd like to ask people that come to the program, when you when the chapter is finally closed and you look back on your career and on your life, how do you define your success and everything you've, you've achieved and accomplished? Um, I think quite early on, I had a, a mental picture of what su success looked like for me, and it's um, it's you know being with my I'm, uh, divorced, so I have the two sons. I think it's you know, looking for would be an older, spending time with them and their families and children, being comfortable enough to, uh, you know, have a comfortable life and to have supported them, but not focused on financial success, but a holistic kind of success, you know, and seeing the, uh, the family deliver as, as well and grow. But I think in addition to that, for me, um, it comes back to my engagement with um, Nigerians and enjoying to, to work here. It's uh, a particularly um, rewarding to, to have young Nigerians that have worked you know, with you and maybe had an opportunity in companies that I rang, ran or you know, through conversations we had or advice. Um, again, success for me is to be be able to walk around and you know I mean this this kind of exactly what we're doing now is a is a great honour and for 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 me in a way that's part of what success looks like because I've always said you know with my grandchildren when they say you know granddad you know what did you do. Uh, when you're in Africa or when you're in Nigeria, I'd always want to be able to say, you know, I left, whatever I did, I left that place better than I found it, or I, I gave as much as I took out. So for me, this picture of success is very broad. It's not, it's not narrow. It's certainly not, you know, financial. I want to be comfortable. Um, don't don't get me wrong, you know, and you need money to get to some interesting places that I want to get to and things to do, but um, it's, not, it's not what defines success for me.